James Corden found himself in a furious bust-up with another cyclist in London on Monday after the TV star was thrown from his bike. The Late Late Show host, 43, was reportedly sent flying from his rented Santander bike during the unprecedented heat wave while cycling down London's Regent Street alongside his wife Julia, 46. The TV star narrowly missed traffic after he was forced to dodge the other man who cut across his path. After the incident occurred, James was filmed looking furious as he picked up his rented bike from the ground and signaled furiously at the cyclist who had collided with him. The former Gavin and Stacey star, 43, appeared to be incredibly riled as his wife seemed concerned about his welfare while stood alongside him after the altercation. James is said to have confronted the other cyclist and was reportedly heard swearing at him following the near crash. One onlooker told The Sun, Corden was fuming. This young cyclist just darted across the road and sent him flying. It must have really taken him by surprise. He had no cuts or bruises but it must have hurt. He ticked off the cyclist who said sorry. Everyone just stopped and stared when they realized who it was. The Mirror has reached out to representatives of James for comment. It comes as Corden is set to step down as the host of The Late Late Show in America. Following the news that James is stepping down from his role, he recently hinted at Gavin and Stacey's possible return by admitting he may soon have more free time. The Smithy actor revealed that the decision to bring back the show is down to his co-star and co-writer, Ruth Jones. The much-loved BBC sitcom, which first aired in May 2007, made a brief return in 2019 with a one-off Christmas special. When asked whether the iconic sitcom could make a return, James recently told BBC Breakfast 2, I wish I could say it's up to me. The best thing about Gavin and Stacey is that it's Ruth and Diane, if I'm being completely honest, her judgment is exceptional. Look, I am going to have a bit more free time as of sort of next year and that will open some time for us to just be together I hope, but honestly, and I'm so touched every time I get here when people ask about it. It's amazing, it's incredible how people care about those characters in the show. It's so great and I realize the ending of that special does very definitely tease something else. But, Ruth is, it's always been the two of us, it's always been. And we can't write separately. We've never been able to write over Zoom or anything at all. We've just got to be in a room together, talking with a pack of post-it notes and a pen and at some point we get a laptop out, but that's even way down the line. And she just always knows.